it. Anyway, Joe Harrison, you've heard us uh, call out his name a few times. That's because we love Joe Harrison because he always brings us the coolest stuff. And I will tell you, this, this one does, uh, never fails to disappoint. Right. I love this item. I own two of these items. It's called the Power Cube. Um, it, it's just a brilliant, brilliant solution. It, should, it could easily be in the Clever with Guy show tomorrow at 7 to 9 a.m. It, it should be. It may it's be. A very clever we may solution. drop it in. But I will tell you, it's a clever solution. Why? Well, it takes any ordinary outlet and it multiplies it by five. One, two, three, four, five. So every single outlet you have, and I'm thinking, where the, let, let me just tell you this, where my TV is, okay, I've got, first of all, I've got powered subwoofer. Right. I have uh, uh, the DVD player. Right. I have the TV. I have the cable box. It's one outlet now. There's one plug. My house, one plug. My house. Not only that, Joe. They're not grounded. <laughs> right. This I is. I had to buy. I had to buy <laughs> adapters for that plug. There's the ground connection. This is also a surge protector oh my as gosh. well. So all of your electronics need to be protected. And you get two. And we get two of them. So normally, when Guy and I first launched this, this was one of these at this price. So I now know. that we have two, it's incredible. But whenever you need more outlets, we have been trained to go out and buy these. Now this technology has been the same since. 1980. Just a bunch of power strips all lined up. However, our electronics have changed. You started getting these little bricks. So I have got four outlets there, plug one in, and I've automatically covered up three. I'm trying to get something else in there in the bottom, and maybe I can get two of them in there at once, and that's it. I just wasted that entire power strip because four of them really only fit two. But with your power cube, those exact same, um, those exact same outlets, I just pop in one there. I can rotate it and pop in another one in. I can rotate it again and pop another one in. I've actually got one, two, three, four, five things that I can plug in all by just plugging one device in. It makes it super simple, super easy to be able to have that. You don't need an electrician. You can just put this wherever it's convenient for you. Now in my household, we have five of us. When we travel. You got a lot of devices, We have Joe. a lot of devices. I know you do. Cell phones, tablets, computers. My kids have every one of these plugged in to their nightstand because what you can do is you can plug in your lamp, you can plug in their device. So right now, I've just got three things plugged in, but it's their computer, it is also their tablet, it's also their cell phone that my daughter will need for school. So I've got three things plugged in, I still have room for two more. And my wife and I, we have a bathroom that only has one outlet in. And guy, the problem is running into is my wife has all these other things I didn't, I don't need. Come on, Joe, you got some stuff in there the too. The curling iron, Joe, I don't need all this stuff. You got stuff a hair dryer. <laughs> Joe, you use that hair dryer. This is her hair dryer, it's not mine. It's this little thing. I don't even know what the differences between these two things are. However, I just want to be able to shave in the morning. If I only had two outlets, I can't do this. But now with the power cube, that one outlet turns everything into five. It gives you the convenience of expanding the power that you have in your home. Because normally, if you want to expand your uh, outlets, you're hiring an electrician. Yeah. It's going to cost you a few hundred dollars. Here, all you need to do is pop the power cube in, and it's all perfect. It, any plug you have, it'll take one plug and turn that's it into it. five. All right? To me, that's that just says it all. Mm -hmm. Without all the extra wires and cables, you know, it always cracks me up that <clears throat> normally in order to extend the number of plugs, you have to plug another thing in. That doesn't right. make any sense. This does it, and it gives you five, but it's not something you have to lay on the floor with a big, long cord. Mm -hmm. It goes right up, and it plugs right in. When you're ordering today, and this is really neat because normally, Joe, we never have all the colors. They no, sell got out. All back. So you can choose two in purple, uh, two in gray, two in blue, two in green, two in red. Everybody gets two. Um, $29.99, they're $10 off, and they're free shipping today. Today's the, to, the day to buy them. Read the reviews. People love these things. I, I, I'll tell you, the mess that I had, not only near my TV in my, in my living room, but in the spare bedroom, because in the spare bedroom, I've got... Um, two lamps, mm -hmm. right? And remember, my house was built in the 30s. There was, the, there's no extra outlets. They put like right. one outlet in each in, room. In it's the entire ridiculous. Room. Right. Yeah. So you have two lamps in that room. My router's in that room. My modem is in that room. So already you got four. Right. If you plug an alarm clock, there's no place to put it. Nowhere to go. So you take one of these, you plug it in. Now I can put five additional electronics in there without taking up space. And look at the mess of all the cords and everything else that you'd have to deal with normally if you had a separate track kind of plug. 
everything stays organized and out of the way. And it only goes about two inches off the wall, That's two and it. a half. Well, it's designed to keep it nice and tight because yeah. for a lot of times, if you want to get that extension or need that extra plug, we buy these extension cords. Right. Now you've got like six, More seven, cords. eight feet worth of cable. But if you've ever bought one of these, one thing Guy mentioned is these are not grounded. We all have these sitting in our house, but the problem you run into is they don't have that ground connection to them. So a lot of our devices, our modern devices, can't fit into it. That's where the power cube does have that ground connection. And what's unique is even on the backside, that little slot right there, that is the reset, the surge protector that's built inside the device. Because most of these power strips, guys, there's no surge protecting it at all. It's just a power extension, right. that's it. This, if you have lightning strike and everything's plugged into this, it's gonna get zapped. If anything gets plugged into this and you have a lightning strike, it's gonna keep it uh, protected because it has that surge. The other thing we do is because this has, takes one plug, and then you get five different additional outlets. We take this everywhere we go to travel. Because we think about like my family five, when yeah. we go to a hotel, hotel rooms don't have any outlets. No, they terrible. have like one outlet plugged into the lamp, one over on the other side of the room. Now we can take two of these, put one on each side of the room, and we're all charging our tablets, we're all charging our devices. It makes it pretty simple. But we stayed at my dad's house earlier this year, and this was what he bought to make sure we had enough power cable. And this was I bet sitting, that was expensive. This was, this was over $70. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this expensive. was sitting on the kitchen countertop. And we always <laughs> would have to move this thing that's around. Nice. You get this big cable there, yeah, everyone's awful. trying to plug into one. So I sent my dad a bunch of these. It just makes it clean. Do you want all this mess of cables? or you take the power cube, you know what, it makes it simple. And you know what's nice about it too, is that because each one of those plugs is essentially facing in a di different direction, exactly you're not competing right. on a strip mm -hmm. um, and having to try to figure out how you're gonna fit them all in because each one has clearance of the other. Um, if you wanna save even more room, you can keep the front one empty. Well, you know, a lot of people do that when they're putting it behind a bed, but then you still have another four plugs that go around the outside that you can use.